This episode of today's iconic moment in New York sports history is presented by Tri-State Cadillac Dealers. March 31st, 1988, Hall of Fame defenseman Dennis Potvin plays his final regular season game at Nassau Coliseum, and the Islanders honor his milestone of 1,000 points in 1,000 games. Potvin was drafted first by Bill Torrey and the Islanders in 1973. He made an immediate impact on the team and won the Carter Trophy in 1974. He first won the Norris Trophy in 1976, and that ended an eight-year run by Bobby Orr. He won it twice more in 1978 and 1979. In his first year as captain, he helped lead the Owls to their first of four straight Stanley Cup championships. To this day, Potvin's Islanders are one of hockey's greatest dynasties. He was the first defenseman in NHL history to reach 1,000 points and is just one of three players to play 1,000 games in an Islanders sweater. Ahead of his final regular season home game at the Coliseum, the Islanders honored Potvin's accomplishments by presenting him with the NHL Milestone Award. New York would go on to defeat the Capitals in that game 7-3. He spent 15 total seasons in the league, all of them with the Islanders. And he was inducted into the Hockey Hall of Fame in 1991. And in 2017, he was named one of the 100 greatest NHL players in history.